Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave Maria. Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Day 23. Our Lady says, My angel, I come to assure your heart of the intention and direction of my petition placed upon you. Dear one, the call I ask to be shared is one not by my title nor by my geographical area, 
for it is my only mission in these days to bring all hearts into union and to lead them into the embrace of my Son through their consecration to my Immaculate Heart and its origin is from heaven above. I shall grant all to fulfill this effort, but I also need your hearts. I desire you to place before my children the call to be one under the banner of my Immaculate Heart and its triumph. Come together now as I have requested, for you know not the global impact of my heart upon the world in these days. Please accept the grace I so long to bestow. I am here to be your refuge. Have no fear of this wish. Guidance Our Lady pleads to us to be consecrated to her. Immaculate heart and to receive and live a call like never given before. She asks us in this day to open our hearts and to allow heaven's grace to flow through each of our hearts. The grave nature of, of her voice once again remains in the seriousness of all God desires to make known today. This call is of a magnitude we cannot fathom. She speaks to us of the importance of these times. We wait on the verge of receiving grace from heaven as never before, and yet the time of grace we are presently in is of such an extraordinary measure. She asks that we join our hearts to her with no hesitation, reservation, or dispensation to totally abandon them to her maternal care. Despite all, she has already given to the world in the course of the centuries, but most especially in our lifetime, we continue to firmly believe that our hearts are held in much better care in our own embrace. Direction We are called to seek as well as our poor frail hearts are able. The desires of God to be completed through our consecration. We are called to seek guidance and direction before the Blessed Sacrament. Let us go before his divine presence to offer ourselves to his holy will. Let us contemplate the breath of heaven upon our heart and soul as given in our consecration. To what height is our soul called to fly? We are invited into the realm of a heavenly coronation. Thus, we must first promise our hearts to his sacred embrace. We must abandon our souls to be adorned in both sorrows and joys. We are asked to lay bare to our desires and resist our own will so that we can be empty and then fulfilled by his command. In the daily application of our consecration, we should find a growth of virtue and grace the mark of the virgin soul belonging to his majestic touch. Meditation O Immaculate Heart of Mary, consummate my soul in God through your maternal embrace. Grant that through meditation, virtue may foster and lead me to an imitation of your state of grace. Enlighten my heart in each day to understand more deeply this divine plan of God. Cultivate in the depths of my being for a longing for truth and justice. Raise the awareness of my soul to the heights that God has deemed for it to rest. Encourage me, dear mother, to belong to heaven and to remain with my feet above the touch of the world. Amen. Psalm 118 verse 105 tells us, Thy word is a lamp unto my feet. Daily Prayers The Apostles' Creed I believe, I believe in God, God the Father, Father Almighty, 
creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. The third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven, and sits at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From thence he shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and, and life everlasting. Amen. Amen. Consecration My, my Queen, my, my Mother, I, I give myself entirely to Thee, and to show my devotion to Thee, I consecrate to Thee this day. My eyes, my ears, my mouth, my heart, my whole being without reserve. Wherefore, good mother, as I am thy own, keep me, guard me as thy property and possession. Amen. Amen. The Angelus. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, And she conceived of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it done unto me according to thy word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners now, and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the word was made flesh, and dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. Pour forth, we beseech thee, O Lord, thy grace into our hearts, that we, to whom the incarnation of Christ thy Son was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection through the same Christ our Lord. Amen sharply of virtues for the virtue of faith our father who art Not in heaven, heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil amen glory be to the father and to the Son, and, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, it's now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Prayer through the Holy Spirit. Come, Holy Spirit, enlighten my heart to see the things which are of God. Come, Holy Spirit, into my mind, that I may know the things that are of God. Come, Holy Spirit, into my soul that, that I belong only to God. Sanctify all that I think, say, and do, that all will be for the glory of God. Amen. For the virtue of hope. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, it's now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen prayer to the Holy Spirit. Come, Holy Spirit, enlighten my heart 
to see the things which are of God. Come, Holy Spirit, into my mind, that I may know the things that are of God. Come, Holy Spirit, into my soul, that I belong only to God. Sanctify all that I think, say, and do, that all will be for the glory of God. Amen. For the virtue of charity. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, it's now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Prayer to the Holy Spirit. Come, Come Holy Spirit, enlighten my heart. To see, to see the things which, which are of God. Come, Holy Spirit, into my mind, that I may know the things that are of God. Come, Holy Spirit, into my soul, that I belong only to God. Sanctify all that I think, say, and do, that all will be for the glory of God. Amen. For the virtue of humility, our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as, as it, it was, was in, in the, the beginning, beginning it's now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Prayer to the Holy Spirit. Come, Holy Spirit, enlighten my heart to see the things which are of God. Come, Holy Spirit, into my mind that I may know the things that are of God. Come, Holy Spirit, into my soul that I belong only to God. Sanctify all that I think, say, and do, that all will be for the glory of God. Amen. For the virtue of patience. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptations but deliver us from evil amen glory be to the father and to the son and to the holy spirit as it was in the beginning it's now and ever shall be world without end amen prayer to the holy spirit come holy spirit enlighten my heart to see the things which are of god Come, Holy Spirit, into my mind, that I may know the things that are of God. Come, Holy Spirit, into my soul, that I belong only to God. Sanctify all that I think, say, and do, that all will be for the glory of God. Amen. For the virtue of perseverance. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, it's now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Prayer to the Holy Spirit. Come, Holy Spirit, enlighten my heart to see the things which are of God. Come, Holy Spirit, into my mind, 
that I may know the things that are of God. Come, Holy Spirit, into my soul, that I belong only to God. Sanctify all that I think, say, and do, that all will be for the glory of God. Amen. For the virtue of obedience. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as, as it, it was, was in the, the beginning, beginning, it's now, now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Amen. Prayer to the Holy Spirit. Come, Holy Spirit, enlighten my heart to see the things which are of God. Come, Holy Spirit, into my mind that I may know the things that are of God. Come, Holy Spirit, into my soul that I belong only to God. Sanctify all that I think, say, and do that all will be for the glory of God. Amen. O Maria, transform my heart unto thine. Place around it a wreath of purity, adorn in virtue. Take my heart, dear mother, consecrated as your own. Present it to God, Father, as an offering from me to you. Help me, O Maria, in each day to make your heart more known. Pentecost prayer. As, As we say this prayer given, given to us by Our Lady, Lady may, may our hearts be open to recognize and accept the gifts of the Holy Spirit. And may we step forward confidently in this battle for the triumph, the triumph of, of the Immaculate, immaculate heart. heart. We are called to, to become a reflection of Christ, a reflection of the, of the face of God, of God that all may be drawn, drawn to, so that, so that his glory may be magnified through our lives. My dear mm -hmm. children, we bring my Jesus such joy today. I pass to you all a great blessing from God. He desires to create in his children unity and glory to his name. Spirit of Christ, stir me. Spirit of Christ, move me. Spirit of Christ, fill me. Spirit of Christ, seal me. Consecrate in me your heart and will, O Heavenly Father. Create in me a fountain of virtues. Seal my soul as your own, that your reflection in me may be a light for all to see. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.